Hello and welcome by the Orchid Saga. And today I thought we we're going to have a look at my beautiful, very big Dendrobium Chrysanthemum orange type. Um, it's a beautiful plant, it's a very big plant. And I have it now, I think, about four years. And every year around this time, it starts to, uh, to bloom. And before they open up completely, I just wanted to show that this is basically how they develop, develop and then they start, like the name suggests, getting their colors. And I know <laughs> that at first I uh, was afraid that I did have some bug blast on them because of the color. But that's how they do. They uh, start to orange up and then uh, slowly they start to open up. Beautiful waxy blooms. They do smell, in my opinion, uh, like honey. Not strong, but not very strong, not, not soft. The, uh, yeah, it's very noticeable if you close up to the, to the plant, the uh, fragrance. But yeah, it's uh, like I said, always around uh, the end of August, the beginning of September, this one starts to, uh, to flower. And I do not have an very very much blooms but we have some because this is a very large cane as you can see <laughs> and what it also does every single time is while it starts to bloom it also starts working on a new growth well actually this growth um, was there for quite a while it's quite big already but it keeps growing that new growth uh, like I said while it's also starting uh, uh, putting out the buds and starts to bloom and after it, it's done blooming it uh, for me it always uh, makes a few keikis two or three keikis and I'm going to move now I don't want to make you dizzy but I have one of those keikis left I had three last time last year I did give uh, two away and I still have one but as you can see this one is also starting uh, making some buds it's only one cane so yeah this one is uh, very uh, quick uh, able to to uh, produce buds apparently but this one I still have around so uh, I found it uh, quite funny and um, yeah normally it takes a few years for most of the orchids I think to be big enough to bloom but this one is uh, quite uh, quickly with uh, with the blooms but, yeah in not that distant future we have uh, some beautiful blooms and I will uh, film them again because they are, I think they are very beautiful but this one uh, was I looked it up to care when I just had it listed as a uh, that it did like a rest but I never give it a rest because like uh, Roger always tells us you need to look at the plant and this plant is always growing a new cane uh, during the winter so it needs its feed and I uh, give it feed I keep the water level up in that reservoir in that pot and um, it's a very fairly big pot and it has a, a lot of roots there are also some roots growing uh, aerial but it also has a lot of roots uh, in a pot and uh, yeah it's already already working on the new cane uh, like uh, we discussed but yeah this is a uh, update on my uh, beautiful very large dendrobium chrysanthemum so i hope you like this video um i just want to say thank you to all the new subscribers i'm really really happy you are uh, here on my channel as well thank you for that F for that i uh, really see it as a uh, support for my channel and um yeah for those who were already here also thank you of course but this is it for now and I hope to see you at one of my next videos. Bye bye.